Hey, what's up everybody? This is Clayton Gonsalves with Go Analytics, and today I want to show you how to connect to Google Analytics data in Power BI. So let's head over to my laptop and I'll show you how to do that. So getting a good understanding of uh, your website traffic is something that's quite important uh, and, and a, every business should be uh, very aware of uh, their website traffic. So how do we connect to our Google Analytics uh, so that we can start visualizing our website traffic? Well, we can go here into Get Data and click on More. And Power BI actually has a Google Analytics connector so that we can use that uh, right out of the box uh, without worrying about any uh, special connectors. So once our data connectors dial-up box uh, appear here, we can just search in the search box here for Google Analytics. And uh, there it is, we'll click on, on that and click Connect. And the Power BI is going to give a warning about connecting to a third party uh, service. Uh, we can just click continue to access this data. And now we'll have to sign in to our Google Analytics account. So if we click sign in, it'll take us to, uh, to a web browser where we're able to uh, select our account. And uh, we'll click allow. And now it says that the sign in was complete and we can close this. So we can just go right back into Power BI desktop. And now it says you are currently signed in. So we're signed in when we can click connect. And now I can see here my website um, and I can expand this to, uh, to get more data. So Google Analytics actually puts all of this data into a cube. So uh, if you're not familiar with working with a cube, uh, you can uh, have a look online. Uh, but it's, it's fairly simple. It means that the, the data is relatively clean for you to, uh, to start working with it. So for example, if I go into uh, page tracking here, uh, I'll be able to get some of uh, the information like page views, uh, entrances, exits, uh, as well as uh, there's other information in here and you can select all of the, the things that you want to see uh, by clicking on the checkbox uh, and uh, and then you'll be able to load that into the model or transform the data so you can go into Power Query Editor and uh, make any, any data cleaning uh, that you need to do. So that's how you connect to uh, Google Analytics data in Power BI Desktop. If you like this video make sure to Click the like button and make sure to subscribe to our channel for more how-to videos in Power BI. See you in the next video.